ride you so hard. Now you're going to think that we're in a damn rodeo. You're going to report to me three times a week here to prove to me that you're not consuming alcohol or dope. You will report to me every Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday here. I, I don't know. I don't know about giving them a PR bond. I haven't decided, but I want to tell you now, you will report to me here every Monday, Thursday, and Friday. You will be signing an affidavit that you're not to drive and not to consume alcohol or legal drugs. And if I find that you do, I will have a contempt hearing. I will slap you with 180 days if you do, probate it for two years, and put you in a lockdown rehab facility where you will be stuck like Chuck for a minimum of nine months, depending on how well you respond to treatment. The only thing I care about in this life is public safety. You continually violate that. How on earth can I justify letting you out on a free bond when it's case after case after case after case? How many aggravated robberies? How many aggravated assaults? And now a DWI where you're allegedly in the car where we have people calling because they're so concerned. Three times a week, you will report to me at 8.30 here to take a drug and alcohol test. Do you understand me, sir? And the one time you failed to come here, holy moly, I'm going to light you up. On one ankle, I'm going to put a scram monitor so I know that you're not consuming alcohol. On your other leg, I'm going to put a GPS monitor and I'm giving you a curfew of 9 p.m. to 6 a.m. If you think that this is going to be an easy ride, you are sorely mistaken. And I'm going to tell you, it's going to be, by the end, you're going to be so sick that I hope that it will, you will think twice before making a move while you're out there in the free world. Listen, man, listen. I'm going to ride you so hard, you're going to think we're in a rodeo. Whatever the fuck he said. Listen, that's crazy. You me major pause. You know what I'm saying? The man said, I want you here Monday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Then he said, I want you here Monday, Thursday, and Friday. You know what I'm saying? He trying to trick you, my boy. I think you better come. He said three days out the week. I think you better come four. You feel me? Pause. You know what I'm saying? Because now he trying, he might he trying to see if you alert or not. You know what I'm saying? He might be testing you. You feel me? You're you're gonna be stuck like Chuck. Like what the fuck do that mean? Maybe he said that cause that rhyme. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. He talking crazy though. He trying to. You feel me? He talking crazy. He trying to paint the picture for you. All that. You know what I'm saying? But in all seriousness, I don't think he. He, he trying to help you. You feel me? He he, try, he giving you a chance. So I suggest you, you feel me? You an alcoholic or whatever. Sober up, my boy, because your chest, you feel me? You got you got all stomach out, no chest. You feel me? You got a stomach, but your chest, where the chest at? You know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? Get out that alcohol, whatever the fuck you done did. You know what I'm saying? He, he giving you a chance, so I suggest you, you feel me, get get on the right path, my boy. You feel me? You, don't, you know what I'm saying? I don't know what you out here doing, but he giving you a chance. Just, you feel me? Clean up, my boy. You feel me? <laughs>